In this short video, I will show you how to set up the Agilent 3000 X-Series oscilloscope to perform eye diagram mass testing on a differential flex ray serial bus signal. The first step is to download the various flex ray mass files that Agilent provides on our website. These mass files are available at no charge. After storing the appropriate files to your USB memory device, insert it into the scope's front panel USB port. The next step in making this measurement is to probe the differential flex ray bus. Agilent recommends using the N2792A 200 megahertz bandwidth differential active probe. Now also available, the special part you can order is a probe head that can attach to this probe that can directly connect to DB9 sub D type connectors. That makes it easy to connect to your circuits. Let's now make a flex ray eye diagram mass test. Begin by pressing the Save Recall front panel key. Next, select Recall, and then navigate to the appropriate mask file. In this case, I'm going to recall a 10 megabit per second TP4 mask file, which is used for testing all signals at the input of a flex ray receiver. When you recall this file, it will automatically set up the scope and begin accumulating and overlaying all received and transmitted bits at our probing point. This is based on triggering on random byte start sequence events from all frames. It then compares these acquired signals to the published eye diagram mask, in this case, a 10 megabit per second TP4 mask. If the signal crosses through any part of the pass-fail mass region, as you see here, failures are clearly marked in red. Also, take note of the fast update rate and mass test statistics. This scope is capable of testing over 200,000 waveforms per second. But what if we didn't want to test all bits from all frames, but only wanted to test bits transmitted from a specific node. First, press the trigger front panel key. Then change from triggering on BSS events of all frames to trigger on BSS events within a specific frame ID. In this case, I have selected to only test bits generated from frame ID 2. To learn more about Agilent's new InfiniVision X-Series oscilloscopes, Contact your local Agilent distributor and ask for a demonstration. Thank you.